Yo, what's going on guys? Today we're gonna drill tap a Hot Wheel. So the first thing we wanna do is drill the holes. I use a Dremel tool with a small bit adapter and a 256 bit. I use the center of the rivet as a guide to ensure the bit goes straight down into the post. Keep in mind, you only need to drill the length of the screw, which isn't very long. So keep an eye on how far the bit's going down. Go slow, apply minimal pressure, and let the bit do its job. Next, we're gonna crack the rivet. Using a bit that's about the same size as the rivet, I think it's a 532 or 564, drill directly down onto it. Go slow, apply minimal pressure. You just wanna crack the rivet and not drill into the base. If you drill too far into the base, the screw will not catch and the car won't, be, won't hold together. So now the car's unlocked and you can see what's inside. There's nice detail in this car and I can't wait to customize it. If your posts are jagged at all, you can use a file to make them flush. Next, we're gonna tap the posts so you can put the screws in. Using a 256 tap and my drill, I slowly drill into the hole until I feel resistance. Once you do, reverse the drill and back out slow. Clear any shavings and repeat two to three times. Repeat for the other side. It's important to clear out shavings as you go to get clean lines. And that's it, we're done. Now we can put our screws in. Now the car is ready to wheel swap, to add some details to it, to throw the body in paint thinner and repaint it. It's unlocked and ready to customize. Hope you learned something. And uh, if you've got any questions, drop them in the box below. Thanks so much for watching and I will catch you all in the next video. Peace.